Hey YouTube, this video is in response to African exports debate and discussion. Should natural hair care be should natural hair care be regulated and require a license? Personally, for me, the answer would be no. Because I, I do believe that it's a cultural thing. It's something, you know, in regards to hair braiding and, and things like that. It's something that you just grow up knowing, you know. Um, but I guess with, with um, the natural hair movement, um, the demand's going to be there for more stylists in salons to, to know how to um, work with natural hair textures. And she asked, you know, would I let someone uh, who does not have a license for natural hair care work on my hair? Yes, but with that being said, they have to have a clientele that have natural hair. They have to have worked on natural hair. I have to see reviews. I have to see raves about their work. You know, I would personally, I would feel more comfortable if the person working on my hair was also also natural. That way, you know, I I uh, I can be assured that she knows what she's doing because you know she has similar textured hair to me and she understands the 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 importance of moisture and 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 all of that other good stuff that comes with natural hair um uh dealing and uh working with natural hair i believe it's a skill set that you just pick up by doing you know i i don't know if they can if they can i'm sure yeah well i'm sure they can teach it in in schools you know um how to deal with hair but personally for me like like you know what the main question was do for somebody to work on my hair do do i feel like they should have a license no as long as they know what they're doing as long as i can see that they have worked with the with my type of hair and um and they have some kind of idea not some kind of idea i need them to know what they're doing since i've gone natural i have not been to a salon the last time i went to a salon i went to a natural hair salon and that's when i got my big chop and all that was was cutting off some hair there was no styling involved or nothing like that it was just cutting so um it you know if i do go to a salon of course i'm gonna i'm gonna want to go to a salon that um specializes in working with natural hair um a lot of people say they like to go get roller sets and stuff like that right now i'm loving my curly hair and i'm actually afraid to get it straightened but that's neither here nor there and that's a whole nother other video so once again just to answer um African exports question no I don't think it should require a license but I do think that you should have a lot of experience and know what you're doing um, I want to say thank you to African export it was a great question it had me thinking and um, comment rate subscribe and I'll see you next time YouTube